Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. You know what I haven't done for a while. And... Uh, yeah, the mailbox. It probably replaced some of the ones I didn't see by now, probably. Oh, oh wait, oh no, so that means that... Okay. So, I just have to check the ones that I had before and then I can get the other ones later then? Because I never had this problem before, because I... I would always check the mail, but I've been so concerned on the dueling. <laughs> Alright, so what do we have here? Uh, okay, so yeah, I will be able to get the others a little bit later on. Alright, I was a little worried about that. <laughs> so this is Ronald about GR number 3 stack. I, I was not checking my mail. <laughs> I've secured some more important information about Team GR. This time I pull all the stops. Don't let my efforts go to waste. I've been shadowing GR number three lately. His deck is now for grass and fire. He sets up his ex executor. Its big explosion can really hurt. So be careful, Ronald Stern Face. And Dr. Mason, deck diagnosis too. It's basically that. Deck analysis system went. Yeah, it's in the step two dealio label uh, now on the on the machine. So yeah, <laughs> uh, but I've already kind of taught you how to do a whole bunch of deck analysis and building and stuff like that. So you might not exactly need it, but it is there. And also, happy face at the end. <laughs> also. Step 3. Alas, alas, he probably has Step 3 ready for us already. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead. Any new decks have been uploaded to my auto deck machine? Why not come back and visit my research center sometime? I'll definitely check them out eventually. The auto deck machine assembles the very, them very quickly for you. We'll let you know about future updates as they develop. Deck Mason's happy face. And a booster pack. These are the kind of things that I was worried about missing. <laughs> Oh, yes, 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 another good Electabuzz. <laughs> uh, oh, regular old Rhydon here. We got Horn Attack. We got a Ram. It's not that, yeah, it, it forces a switch, and Rhydon's got a lot of HP, but it costs a lot, a lot of energy cards to use that bad boy. Hello, extra double colorless. Yes. Pokemon Trader, too, very nice. Um. Okay. Alright, so. Let's just see what ha- Dive. Oh, okay, that's the end of that. <laughs> Let's see what happens if we wipe out some of these things here. And, yeah, just go ahead. There we go. Uh -huh. <laughs> and, yes, please. So, uh, I'm hoping that they'll send more after I do this. Because, otherwise, I technically missed some messages. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna go out of here. Minicom, mailbox, no new mail. Okay, so maybe we have to wait for more mail, or maybe we have to turn off the game or something like that. So we're we're good for now, I think. If not, I'll have to find the transcript or something. <laughs> Alright, so we're going over to the psychic stronghold after cleaning out our mail. What about that? Cleaning out our mailbox. You made it here quickly, Mint. It's me, Ronald. Good to see you again. Is it? Did you have some trouble in the GR Fighting Fortress's labyrinth? I got sick of waiting for you. Listen, I have new Team GR Intel. There's a man called the GR King in the GR Castle just north of here. There's a catch, though. You need two coins to meet him. Those would be the GR Psychic Coin and the GR Colorless Coin. You should get them quickly and attack that castle. I'll do my best. It depends on if there's a lick tongue But seeing how slow you work, I bet I'll get there first! I'm off! Later, Mint! And he's off. <laughs> and let's take a look around here. Woohoo! So you've already made it here, eh, Mint? That's great and all, but you'll never defeat our King Velocini! Maybe you'll, you should rethink your minute <laughs> motors before continuing on. Well, we'll see about that. <laughs> oh, everyone's saying, oh ho ho. I wish to trade cards. I'm looking for a Dark Hypno level 26. I'll give you my rare Mewtwo level 60 card in exchange. What do you say? Mmm, little miss? Why, yes, I would like that, as a matter of fact. I trust my darling Mewtwo level 60 card to you. Woo! It's the movie promo, Mewtwo! A powerful Mewtwo! It's, yeah, you, you might know this one from another one. 
Grab two energy cards from this card pile, attach them, and then Cyburn for 40. So yeah, it's pretty versatile little kitty there. Well, kind of mid-game, so to speak. <laughs> I'm so very happy. <laughs> Do you remember the card you gave me? It was a Dark Hip level 26. I've been using it well. That's good to hear. You don't even see me leave my sight anyway. I've been trying my hardest to make a good deck for Team GR, but I just can't. After all, Team GR decks are known to be, I mean, known as the best of the best. I don't know about that. Once I make one, I'm going to duel Heidi, a psychic member of Team GR. Alrighty, so I guess we're good here. And, receptionist! Thank you for visiting. This is Team GR's psychic stronghold. This fortress is the last structure protecting GR Castle. Not really, we just heard from Ronald that there's the colorless, I mean GRX, but there's the colorless, never mind. The leader of the psychic stronghold is a woman named Claire. Alongside her are four other Team GR members to fight. Ooh! Out of these four, you only need to defeat three members to move on. Well, you know I'm gonna battle them all, so <laughs> let's just throw that off the table. Learn, off, <laughs> learn about each member's special battle rules inside. That is all. Please enjoy dueling in Team GR's psychic stronghold. Thank you. Thank you. So, hmm. Hmm, got some spikes, got some test tubes. Hmm, uh, I don't know, I'm not, not really seeing anything around here, so... I don't know, maybe no one's home. Hmm, oh, wait, 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 right there! Mint! Woo! <laughs> the name's Claire. I'm the leader of Team GR's Psychic Stronghold. Do -do -do -do. So you're the troublemaker trying to recover the cards you've stolen. You called me a troublemaker, and then say you stole cards. Let that sink in for a bit. You've indeed come far. I won't praise your efforts, though. I assume you set your sights on a GR castle? Well, you've got to get through me first, kid. I won't go easy on you. However, if you do happen to beat me, I'll admit my defeat. Allow me to introduce my fellow Stronghold members. First is Clyde, to my left. <laughs> Thanks so much, I'm Clyde. Next is the young and talented Victoria. Mint, I've been waiting. Uh-huh, it's GR number four! <laughs> Easy, Victoria. Please wait for me to complete my instructions. It wasn't that loud. You don't have to be so strict. There you go again. You won't listen to a word I say. Oh, jeez, violence! Okay, 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 stop it, please. I'll be quiet. Woo! <laughs> I bet you never suspected the famed GR number three could be so pretty. Wait a second, she said GR number three, but she's clearly GR number four. There must have been a typo somewhere. That's right, cute little Victoria was GR number three the whole time. Okay, maybe not, huh? <laughs> oh, jeez. Up next is Kevin. <laughs> yeah! Hi, I'm Kevin. We're well met, Mint. Finally, allow me to introduce my daughter, Heidi. You only need to defeat three of these strong old members to move on. If you can manage that, I'll turn my elevator on for you. I'll be waiting for you in the upper room. And so she goes. And I'm gonna go from left to right, for the sake of organization. I'm Kevin, one of Team GR's Psychic Fortress members. Battles with me are a bit extreme. I use a custom rule for resistance. Instead of the usual minus 30, all resistance is a minus 10 reduction. Dun 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 dun! If you feel confident with a minus 10 resistance, let us start the duel! No. Feel free to challenge the other members if you like. It's a okay. Yolo, Mint! You up for a card battle? I'd like to change the game mechanics a bit for resistance in my duels. We're just going to the 30, but the 10, remember. Shall we begin then? Sure, we should be just fine with Fireweed. Super effective deck! <laughs> Low resistance is a factor, but that is okay. So, yeah, I'm using my Fireweed. So, it's, everything should be okay. It's all gonna come out pretty even overall. Oh. Except if I don't have energy. And basic Pokemon that match the energy that I have. Uh, I mean, I, I, yeah, more basic. Oh, and ooh, okay, we we got something here. We got something here. Um, yeah, this this Abra, by the way, I keep forgetting to mention, might be a slight upgrade over the original Abra, uh, because of its 
It's got the same Psy Shock, but it's also got Vanish. But in exchange for the extra HP of 10 as well, it's got a retreat cost of 1 instead of 0. I keep forgetting to mention that. And she's... Yeah, that could be a problem of a Mewtwo. But anyway. Uh, I guess I'll just attack with the Tackle. Can't really do much of anything else. It's like it's Scyther out there, so I'm just kind of... Let that go and see how things flow. And paralysis, of course. Of course, you're gonna get you're gonna get the head flips all day and all night, aren't you? Aren't you? <laughs> Another fire. Um. Uh, and you know I didn't take out my grass energy, by the way. <laughs> Alright, give that to sight there and call it a turn. Cause yeah, I have not tweaked my deck since you last seen it, and I was still grassing it up. So. Eh, okay. So I can freely tackle or retreat over to Scyther and finish off the Abra, which I probably will do. Oh, sure, now! Because <laughs> I'm going to go to Scyther, and I'm also going to use one of my overabundance of fire, so I can just do a slash <laughs> and save my good old Bulbasaur for later. That possibly could come in handy, <laughs> unless I don't get a Charmander at this rate. Because, yeah, I got Charmeleon in my hand already, so... Plus a double colorless. We'll see how things go. And Abra's probably gonna cause paralysis to me. Based on my luck. Okay, no. <laughs> because it was only that guy who was using the game shark. <laughs> Alright. Fire. Well, grass. I'm gonna put that in there. Um, I could Pokemon Trader into a Charmander and then start attacking with Charmeleon. But then I'd have to give up my Charizard and... We'll just see how things go. <laughs> I'm in a decent position anyway, you know, so... We'll just see how things go. He's probably gonna retreat Abra. Probably. Really? Okay. I, thought it was, I, would, I would have bet you were gonna retreat, unless you knew the coin flip was gonna go ahead because you turned on your Game Shark. Who knows? Who knows? All I know is... Maybe I should Pokemon Trader. So I'll go with Charizard, swap for... M -m 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 which Charmander though? This one or the other Charmander? I'm thinking the other Charmander. Because, yeah, because it's got more HP, and I might actually need that. And we'll call it a turn. I'm just probably going to end up evolving it straight over to Charmeleon ASAP anyway, but... Ooh, that could be a problem. We'll see though. <laughs> Nothing. Alright, so that Abra is a goner, so I'll get another prize card. And oh, sure, now I get another. After I played Pokemon Trader, sure, now you give me. I'm playing the first one, though. How you like those apples? <laughs> Just because, despite that draw, I've only got two of those Charmeleon in my deck, too, so it's like. I, I get both of all times. Alright, so the bench manipulation could cause a decent amount of damage, but it'll probably be... I was gonna say it'll probably be 20, but it, it, no. <laughs> no. Oh wait, that, oh, that was Tails! Yeah, I, I forgot. Well, okay, you're getting the coin flips again. <laughs> I'll prepare a Bulbasaur, um, like, like, sort of, like, set up in the future, because I could do five, I have 50 damage with Charmeleon. So in the meantime, I'm just gonna do a little scratch with, yeah. <laughs> uh, so yeah, in the meantime, I'm just gonna do that and tackle with Bulbasaur. I'll let him knock out Hypno if he wants to, it'll, it'll be okay. <laughs> just finish him off really quickly with that Charmeleon when the time is a right -ah. There we go. -ah. And now he's in trouble. Was <laughs> it just like, yeah, you don't really have... All that much to go by here. That Mewtwo with the side crash would be handy if I was using psychic Pokemon, but I'm uh, not. So uh, I'm gonna go set that up for the future and discard one fire. And there goes Dark Hypno. Very nice. Here comes the Mewtwo. I pretty much expected that, but it's not really gonna be. It's it's not gonna make it. It's <laughs> It can't attach that many energy per turn, and yeah. So I'm gonna. I should actually do this. I'm gonna go discard that and grab some of those fires just in case things go south. And flamethrower. There we go. He's probably gonna retreat Mewtwo. 
Oh, that shouldn't be that big of an issue. At least I, I thought he was going to retreat the other critter. But that didn't work out, so... Okay, he's doing that, and no, he's not, because it costs two energy cards to retreat Mewtwo, so he's a goner. Yep, he's just like, uh, might as well just evolve that for the fun of it. And, yeah, I'm just gonna use Flamethrower for the fanciness. And I could use Slash as well, but yeah. <laughs> Voila! I think I was in pretty decent control of that game. <laughs> I guess I lost your toughness, except in the early game, but happen sometimes. And... oh man, oh man... There's a lick my nemesis lick <laughs> uh, Legends booster pack. We get... Duplicate Hitman Liam... Regular Rhyhorn. I've had defending Pokemon can attack this Pokemon during your bonus next turn and horn attack for 30. So again, like the ride on, it costs a lot of energy. Uh, female leader and 10 damage times number of heads and call for family. You know, Goldine. You know, fighting energy. It's rare for my psychic powers to be so inaccurate. Oh, I guess I should activate my elevator switch for you then. When the suit three and the your lights are lit, you can use it to meet Claire. You can't reach her any other way, I'm afraid. So you just walk off the switch and it automatically activates. It kind of makes sense. All right, next duelist. Are you choosing me as one of your battle opponents? All right! I'm a strong, serious, and determined fighter. There's no way you'll be able to top my deck this time. Nope. My challenger requirement is a restriction on energy type. The only energy cards you're allowed to use are psychic energy cards. I hope your deck is made with the psychic type in mind. Come on, come on, let's fight. I'm gonna blow you away! Whoa! Yes. No, wait, 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 wait! What do you think you're doing? You've got energy cards that are psychic type in your deck. You wanna test your mind against me, correct? Get rid of that other energy and replace it with psychic type energy. Well, you're in luck! Because I have set up my paralyzed deck ahead of time, well, except I forgot the energy, I guess. But <laughs> I'll just uh, I'll just do a little swapper swapper. <laughs> oh, the poop! Did I forget to do that swapper swapper? I don't know. I don't know. But look at that. We got 20 there. We are good. No. All right. So let's <laughs> give another look. See, I'm I'm gonna try this version of Abra. As I was saying, might be a slight upgrade. Cadabra. This Jinx. Oh, actually, oh, that's right, it uses the water. Forgot about that. <laughs> oh, okay, so let's do another Jinx, too. Like, maybe that one. Got that Jinx. I got this Mewtwo because of Psychic Energy. Yeah. Uh, complete Recovery. But actually, maybe I'll use that other Mewtwo promo that I got. I thought I'd use this Mewtwo as well, just for the sake of variety. Yeah, why did I even choose that, <laughs> that Jinx? Oh, jeez. Um... Rotata! Resistance to Psychic! Aha! Uh-huh! Same with Radicate. Same with the Jigglypuff and Wigglytuff. Tauros as well, so... I'm still pretty well prepared. Aside from a certain... Certain issue down below here, isn't it? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> and I use the Energy Absorption <laughs> Alright, so... We're good to go. I hope your deck is made with only psychic type energy cards. If it is, I'll accept your challenge and show you how strong I've become. No. What? 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 You gotta fight the other members instead. Fine. Get out of my face then. M -m 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 Aha! Your deck's energy cards are all psychic type. They're all water type at some point. But <laughs> let's start that show right with four prize cards. And she's got like a fanfare going on in the background. <laughs> See, you can have a little fun reading that off on the side. Yeah, come on! <laughs> as, as you know, she's kind of on the popular side, especially in the, the lightning place. <laughs> Why did I do that? I was just laughing at the... Oh, well, whatever. Alright, let's go. I'll play Bill <laughs> next turn. I got my resistance going on here, so I should be alright. And, oh man, it's the energy spike version. But, yeah, it kind of switch swaps the energies around, so if something goes awry with my Tauros, that, 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 I, 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 he's just going to end up powering up my, yeah. And then, it, that kind of annuls my Tauros anyway. But anyway, I'm going to do Bill. And we're going to go, pop that on there. 
I guess I will power up Toro so like I'm gonna set him up for the future and let her do the energy transfer and then I'll energy removal. <laughs> uh, pulling out Dark Cadabra, that's alright if you'd like to. Probably gonna give the energy... Wait, what? You, you have no energy cards. Ooh, no, that's not good for you. Oh, man, especially since I got the energy removal deck. Well, she probably won't be able to do that much unless she gets some good draw cards. <laughs> okay, energy removal, that'll help her a little bit. No, that's, yeah, that's not an energy card. So we're gonna go plop that on there, and I even got Professor Oak on my own, but I don't want to dump my energy removals when I'm in this sort of position, you know? So, I'm just going to keep on stomping on and allow myself to wipe out the... Oh, yeah! <laughs> As you see it on the picture. Uh, and allow myself to wipe out the Mewtwo. Probably, uh... Other than, uh... Uh-huh. Well... <laughs> sorry! <laughs> uh, that's, that's, my, that's my paralysis deck in a nutshell. Alright, let's do the Stomper, and wipe out the Mewtwo, -ah. there we go, -ah. so much for that uh, resistance, -ah. I mean, uh, no uh, weakness and resistance applied there. Mm, okay, so I guess I'll start going for that, I mean, I don't really have to, but as long as I just want to make sure Tauros is powered up and whatnot, like the Rampage, you know, it's a... Yeah, you do that with more damage counters, so I'm gonna focus on uh, just the stomp for now. But I just want to make sure Tauros is good to go. Nothing? Nothing! I find this hard to believe. <laughs> and I don't want to plop that on the bench. Um, I got all my Kadabra too, but I, so I really don't want to. <laughs> really don't want to Professor Oak now. Alright, stop. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, I thought I was gonna knock out Rattata because I figured my tail flips would end. It did not. Oh, 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 oh! Okay, we got something here. Oh, Abra? Oh, no! That's... <laughs> then I'll be able to Professor Oak. So on the next turn, so that's, uh... Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, jeez! I could say my deck is working perfectly, technically, because I'm preventing her from using anything. Uh, oh, ooh! Okay, so she's just stall a little bit more there. Um, let's go ahead and power up something else here. Go with that. I think I got enough. I, got, got, I think I got enough Mewtwo's here. That was Professor Oak and fill up my hand once again. And... Let's see if she actually accepts it. Really. I figured you'd have been happy to thin your deck out a little bit there. Alright. Oh, that's right. Uh, anyway. Let's see here. Yeah, I think... I think I'm just gonna stop. Heads, please. Thank you. This is about time. <laughs> and I, I think I ran out of energy removal anyway. Uh, nope. Finishing the turn. Not gonna... Not gonna retreat. I thought you would've retreated, but... Maybe Tauros is just too... Too threatening. Hmm... Let's go with that. And... Okay. So that's a KO. And well, I guess you, you would have had to retreat anyway, technically. Kangaskhan. Yeah, that's what I thought you would have treated to, retreated to. Did you see your face there? <laughs> I'll get out. Oh, yeah. Bleah. <laughs> and... Hmm. What can I do? I can't, like, attack... Kangaskhan very quickly with anything I've got right now, so that might actually be quite helpful for her, especially with Fetch, as long as she got an, she's got an energy card. But for now, I'm gonna go with that and continue stopping away. Because, yeah, if I put out Kadabra to try and do 50, it'll only do 30. Not there, Kadabra. If you don't have energy, though, that's not... Okay, there you go. See, the Fetch here is gonna be... That's gonna be probably the deal-breaker of things. Uh, ooh, I got plus power. That could be a nice surprise. Wait, wait, which 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 Mewtwo is which? I probably want to go with the first Mewtwo then. And stop. Let's go. 
And yeah, I don't want to confuse myself with Tauros either, so I just thought I'd consistently do 20 or 30 damage. Uh-huh. So next turn... I mean, I should say the turn after next turn, I will win because I have plus power unless she swaps out the Kangaskhan. But yeah, it's like she's not really doing much of anything. I wonder if I should give her another chance. I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of, kind of a long duel as it is, just based on her... Uh, HP critters. <laughs> we'll see though. But yeah, actually, I don't need the plus power now. Uh, yeah, that's uh, hmm, uh, hmm. <laughs> Might as well <laughs> not do anything else. I have energy removal. As you seen, I drew there. Oh, jeez. Well, yeah, yeah. I didn't really. She couldn't really do anything. Yeah, yeah, I can't believe it. She lost. I'm so tough. Was I that tough, or did you just get bad draws? Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, here we go. We got, we're all gonna get some new cards here. Uh, or maybe not. <laughs> maybe. Maybe not, okay. <laughs> It's no wonder I lost so badly in your prior confrontations. Here, I'll, I'll activate my switch. You could thank me later. <laughs> she pushed me aside. And the three lights are lit. The elevator is activated. I bet you you already knew that from before, right? Yep. You already beat me with your super stupid superhuman abilities. Where are they? You have to defeat the other members now if you want to go on. Alright, I'm, I'll do, do it here again. What, do you want to fight against all these superior abilities again? Wait. <laughs> Superior? Doesn't that mean you're a stronger player than others? But I just... Well, never mind. Don't get too cocky just because you beat me. Okay, in your previous duels. Alright, I've been raring to go. But remember, I have special rules, restriction of energy. Yes. Alright. Uh, this, this is your last chance. <laughs> now watch her beat me. <laughs> just, just because. Uh, okay, I got Tauros again. Let's try that again then, I suppose. See how things go. Cause I already got the Rattata for resistance in the future and whatnot. Hopefully she doesn't leave with the Mewtwo that has, uh... Oh, she did. <laughs> well, okay, we'll see how things go. I, I guess uh, this is a si very similar beginning here. Done. <laughs> Alright, boss's way, Dark Cadabra for the Abras, of course. And here comes the energy spike. Maybe she'll be able to move it, maybe she won't. She did not. So I will go ahead, plop down there. I'll even do that. I'm definitely doing that. And heads, please. Thank you. And... I know she just has low energy in her deck or something like that, I don't know. Alright, energy spike, maybe she'll be able to offset. Nope. So I could still knock out that Mewtwo uh, pretty rapidly. Actually, I, actually, I'll guarantee I'll knock out that Mewtwo. If I get Tails, it won't matter, yeah. <laughs> just, just to be sure, because that's going to cause some ire with the energy swapping. So yeah, there's the other Mewtwo. And try and get rid of this one as quickly as possible. Oh. Well, well, let's see how things go here. Because she's put it on the Rattata. So I could just keep Tauros probably filled with energy to continue stomping away. Yeah, that's, that's looking pretty good there. And just let her power up my other Pokémon in whatever way she pleases, I guess. Assuming she'll get head coin flips. And head coin flip of the... Yep, okay. <laughs> and that's okay. Oh! Oh, no, no, no. I did not just get... <laughs> oh no! <laughs> well, now she's not gonna be side burning. Energy removal. Okay, that might be working for you because then if you get the head up here, that will prevent Tauros from attacking. Ooh, okay, you've actually got something going here. Uh, I'm gonna definitely get a Kadabra probably going there. Uh. Should I go for that, or should I just go for the Rattata? Yeah, I think I'll go for the Kadabra and end the turn. She can 
go ahead and knock out Tauros if she wants to, I guess. Uh, I've got a bunch of other stuff waiting in the wings, including the other Abra and the Rattata to boot, so there you go. You can yeah, you can just do a little little bit of that. Okay. <laughs> okay, we got that. Follow that up. And end the turn. Yeah, because I'm at an awkward spot because of the head coin flips. So, yeah, just kind of forced to do other sorts of powering up otherwise, which is no big deal because the energy card just kind of moved around. <laughs> just go with Rattata. And plop that on there. Kadabra, and we will bite. Take a little piece out of that um, Mewtwo. And the side duck pops out. She seems pretty happy with that draw. Maybe because she's getting energy this time. Uh, she's not going to be able to really, yeah, not really going to really attack with that. Professor Rogue, that'll be very helpful for her. And boss's way. Dark Cadaver again? Really? I mean, I guess it's okay. <laughs> but anyway. Oh, uh, yeah. Dark Goldock, it's, uh, needs a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. I think uh, Rattata will take care of that before the, before things get out of hand. Probably, <laughs> we'll see. Uh, it is a water Pokemon though, so there's no no sort of resistance going on. Ooh, I see. I see. Oh, but you're still not you're not powering up. Okay. <laughs> All right. Bite and call it a turn. So yeah, I was I was expecting her to use Dark Golduck because I'm using. Colorless Resistance, so I thought you would use that to kind of try and sweep my field, which is not. <laughs> maybe I maybe I shouldn't have given her another chance. She might just not be one of the best players out there. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna defend Rotata just in case and do a bite because something else may be a coming. <laughs> maybe I don't know. I, I'm not counting on it. Especially since she put out Psyduck, and she's got the dizziness to draw a car that's not going to do any damage at all. I mean, even, as a matter of fact, that Psyduck can't do any damage because she's only got Psychic Energy. Um, let's go ahead and I guess power up the Jinx and nibble away. <laughs> I could actually switch over to Kadabra and just win, <laughs> but let's just see what she does. I mean, I could, could literally win any time now, even on the last turn. Alright, uh, so there we go. Let's plop it on the Jigglypuff in case of Wigglytuff. And, yeah. And you know, Rotana's got a free retreat cost too, right? <laughs> there we go, Pokemon Trader. And yeah, I, I just... Oh, 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 oh! We got, we got something going on here. We got something going on here. And actually, if I if I still switch over to Kadabra, it's still an automatic win because of double psychic damage. So yeah, all right. There's the Mind Shock. Ignores the weakness and resistance. Sorry. <laughs> I don't have, I don't have a Wigglytuff, but I don't need it. I got the Super Psy, which will do 100 to that Dark Alakazam. Yeah, it's just. I, I think her deck is just my I, my deck is just too. Too well built versus hers because it just has a counter for everything. That 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 might just be it in general. What? Why? Why do I have to lose when I'm so strong? <laughs> I even gave her a second chance and multiple chances in that game. <laughs> this is not not happening. This is not happening. Not her day. <laughs> and premiere once again. Another my champ. Oh no, oh, ooh, oh, 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 anyway, <laughs> uh, okay, we're good, <laughs> don't think you're hot stuff just because you overcame my strength, well, I, I did it twice, so, <laughs> I, I, mean, I, 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 I technically didn't have that many issues with you normally, and anyway, so I, I don't know, I don't know what to make of this. <laughs> <laughs> All I know is with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when I beat the other two members. Probably. I mean, maybe they'll be so powerful I won't be able to. <laughs>